Hi, I'm Jeff Lytle. Join me right here Sunday morning at 10 on ABC7 for Naples Daily Newsmakers. Our guests this week include Rob Mower. He's the president and CEO of the Conservancy of Southwest Florida and Collier County Commissioner Tim Nance. We'll discuss the action taken by the Collier Commissioners about future oil and gas drilling in Collier County and whether the commissioners have gone far enough and the role other organizations will play in the eventual new rules. Then we'll also talk about a new high school potentially for Bonita Springs. We'll talk with a member of the, of the task force looking into that project east of I-75, Christine Ross. She's the leader of the Bonita Springs Area Chamber of Commerce. And here's what she has to say at the potential of a new high school for that South Lee County area. Uh, there will be concerns. Right now there's a water task force that's mm -hmm. completing its work. Yeah, for city council. And so they will have some recommendations for city council and I'm sure the school district will take those into consideration. But the fact of the matter is you already have BSU out there in the DRGR, you have the YMCA, mm -hmm. you have many housing developments on the south side of Benita Beach Road that are all built in former DRGR property. Mm -hmm. So I think we, we need to concentrate on the big picture and a high school for Bonita Springs is really what the future needs. It'd be a big deal. Huge deal. And Christine Ross from the Bonita Springs Area Chamber of Commerce says this would not be a charter school. This would be a full high school sponsored by Lee County Public Schools. So we'll stay tuned for more details about that and a lot more Sunday morning at 10 right here on ABC7.